and them have a thing say there's someone I can to them we dead 2,000 years ago when come back now and take her out of the misery we will find ourselves in her. So, what if we not do not know what I'm saying? Just pray. Just pray. And the blood of Jesus will wash away all madness. Well, that is 2,000 years now. And we see more blood that come now. It's not Jesus' blood. It's children, the blood of the children, the mothers. Blessed love, my viewers and subscribers, Wagwan. Hope you are doing good. Hope you are doing great. Now, my people, we are here again on the Soul Chat TV with another Mutabarka content. And this one is the latest cutting edge as of April the 3rd, 2024. The latest, my people. This one will be long, but it's filled with pure educational content inside. To open your imagination to a wider perspective of life. The main topic of this one, we are the only race that is going backwards. For some reason, Mutabaruka will explain that. Now my people, this one will be a bit long, but it's packed with pure educational content to open your imagination to a whole different dimension so people settle in relax and take in the cutting edge because it's going to be a journey very very interested journey my people and you know it's a black poor movement so definitely drop a like share with a friend or a family and also Remember to subscribe if you haven't done it already. Now, let's walk. Louis Farrakhan. You know, my father come from long in the south there, you know. Yeah, in a Kingston, yeah. Think your mother come from Grenada. Louis Farrakhan said the white man heaven is a black man hell. White man heaven is a black man hell. I will to tell you about that. <laughs> I will to tell you about that, man. Trust me. Undoubtedly. We're going to take a break, first break, and come forward. Yes, yes we're there with you, as we say. Cutting edge style, you know, we this. We're going to play an next Farrakhan, you know. We're going to play an next Farrakhan. Let's look at a speech delivered by a white slaveholder, Willie Lynch. He said, quote, I use fear, distrust, and envy for control purposes. I have outlined a number of differences among the slaves, and I take these differences and I make them bigger. Uh, them call it the Willie Lynch syndrome. All the things them hear him say inside it. So that is what them do. Use the dark skinned slave against the light skinned slave. Use a woman against the man. Still a go on. Still a go on. I mean, I'll tell you, man, when you listen to them things, man, it makes you just go in on yourself. Yeah, it makes you go in on yourself and really think that after so long, after so long, it looked like black people have moved backwards. Back where we are walk, outside where we are walk. We don't want to go forward. We, 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 we move sideways, we move back where. I don't know which part is where we want to move. Why the messenger is still relevant today? Why the messenger is still relevant today? And when we look on the other races, they might move forward and still like dig out the land them. We are not for them own. Because we still don't understand about the power of land and land ownership. You know, when 
them take you from Africa. We never have no wire fence. And them bring you come over here, so. And then them have wire fence. And them have our ancestors as slaves. And then them say them free we. But them free we pump for them land with them teeth already. So if you know them say them free, we will never have nowhere to plant nothing to take care of family. So you find, say, we depend on them land, so called for them land. And now them call we squatter. Because we are squat on the crown land or the private investor land. Black people will not realize eh, every war that are going and was going on from them time there was fought over land. Land is a whole heap of war going on. Check all of the war that we are going on now. Check all of them and see if it's not land. It's fight them and fight over land. Because them know the land is power. But try real estate can't get old. Cause the land now move. And the older it get, and the more expensive it get. Especially like how when them start to build up certain things beside it. Some place where it was just land. You all are like a kite and you see them put up a big gated community beside it or a hotel. You know, far the land they got now. But we don't realize how important land is. We don't understand the importance of land. So them have a, 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 a live on gully bank, gully edge in a river dry up river upon this edge of some hillside but when water come it soften the earth and wash away all of your things them land look upon it look upon the earth check the land them check the country them we're in a war right now and see if it's not land them a fight over even in Haiti why you think America down there is the land them want because they know the certain things under the land where they need to develop them modern world. That is where they really did it for. Where you think so they go Africa for? The people and the natural resources where they upon the land. They have always been fighting for land. Because they know what how it is to have land. Why you think them reach America? A thief, them a thief, the people them land. I know them a call the people them alien. In a them own land. Them who come from Europe and Ireland and Germany and all them places there. I end up in America. Them go to like say them never see no people there on the land. And the people them there on the land and them go to go kill them off. And push them west. West, 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 west. In you know, some dry up part of the land, them Arizona, Texas, and all them places there. Eh? And divide up the place and call it all sorts of things. Land is power. Land is power. Is African race. You know, the thing with this thing, I know, is that. Even though people hear the song, them, them hear it, but them not listen to it. It's just that, you know, them hear it, but them not listen to it. Because there's so much of these songs have been made. So much poems have been written, so much books. And we are more back with the same way. We are more back with the same way. Anyway, today is Empress Men in Earth Day. Who is Empress Melin? She is the Empress of Ethiopia during the reign of Ayla Selassie. Ayla Selassie, wife, Empress Menin. 
We know only for Rastafari celebrate it. I think 12 tribe have a celebration right now. I go on to celebrate Empress Menin. There are books on Empress Menin that I think say it's very important if one's on one go really find out about this woman. This woman who I listen as a text as his wife. So in lieu of that, we want to play. And when I said this is, when I call it woman month, may I tell you, everybody have a month now. So here we go. May I tell you, man, can you imagine if all of the radio station in Jamaica? Come together and say, they are gonna play some of them junior one day a week, just one day. All them not have to do it one time, you know, but them do it, you know, different different times. But can you imagine if them just decide to say one day a week, all of them are gonna just play them kind of music? Yeah? Don't tell me say it could make a difference, you know. Because them hear the other kind of music every day and it make a difference. <laughs> it make a difference when them hear the same madness every day. Make a difference. And when the music was in a prime time, when man and man did really a right liberation music, you see the difference where it make? Yeah, man. Whole heap of difference. It, it rise up whole heap of people. We really need to over what really happened to you as African people. Because the educational system is still there. But you have things right now where we can do, and that is to educate yourself, not through the school system, but where would I call first time the street corner university? There was a time when we used to sit down certain street corner and just attack and a reason about things on time. We never did have burn no herbs. We never did have no liquor in our hand. We just sit down and attack. And when we see a jeep I come down the road, we run. <laughs> we call a police that and a peer problem if them see you sit down on the corner there. Them things say you're up to something. They don't know say you and you could have sit down on the corner and just a reason. And not have no ganja and no liquor in them hand and no gun. And all them something there. No. Them youth, you know, them sit down on a corner with herbs in them and rum in them cup. And some of them have gone to them back pocket. And when them see the police are come, them now run. <laughs> them now run. Different mindset. Different mindset. When we look on the mothers, them, and the mothers are gold on Saturday night. Or Sunday night, or even Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday night. You have another night. When them women are gold, some of them borrow them grand picnic clothes. Bar they don't care the clothes tight up on them. They don't care. They want in fashion. Because after them things, fashion over style, you know. Because I realize I hope I want to know the difference between being fashionable and having a style. Well, if people don't understand the levels. Because style is your personality. Fashion is where everybody have on. And your feet say you should have it on too. It's in fashion. Style is you. That distinguishes you from the crowd. And most people don't want. Look that way because I hear you are dancing. You never talk about fashion over style. And that them say fashion over style. So nobody not have their own style. At least some people still, and I say everybody, but some people 
of them own style. Most people follow fashion. You know, when we are used to say, follow fashion, monkey can't never drink good soup yet. I don't know where the hell them get that they talk from. Follow fashion, monkey never drink good soup yet. I don't know if monkey drink soup. Or who give the monkey the soup? Who cook the soup? So when we look at all the things I said, African people, no one asked them African. That's the first thing. When them close their mind and I dream, or when them close their mind and I pray, or when them close their mind and I think, they want something to come save them out of the sky. That's why the, 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 the national anthem say, grant true wisdom from above. Grant true wisdom from above. Where's wisdom coming from above? Above where? So them have we in this pie in the sky illusion. And them have we a thing say there's someone according to them we dead two thousand years ago. We can come back now and take we out of the misery. We will find ourselves in now. So, what if we not do not know what I'm saying? But pray. Just pray. And the blood of Jesus will wash away all madness. Well, that is 2,000 years now. And we see more blood that come now. It's not Jesus' blood. It's children, the blood of the children, the mothers. If you don't mind sharp, you have to cry and drink the water, your, your, your tears, for quench your thirst. And we're going continuously, continuously going on like everything is okay. And we know everything now okay. We know that. And we know what to do, you know. We know what to do. But the, the, the things that surround me is so, it's, it encompass our resilience to resist. We should be resisting, but we get complacent and very comfortable in the kidnapping of our parents and we and we have a saying I even mentioned it all the while the Stockholm Syndrome Stockholm Syndrome if you say you don't know what the Stockholm Syndrome is is when a man kidnaps somebody and the one who is kidnapped start to love him kidnapper Many a times this happen. Will you a young girl get kidnapped by men who rape them, rape them, rape them? And somehow, when them realize that them not escape, the girl that is, them start to love the kidnapper. And that is where we reach African people. We start to love our kidnappers. And them still have in a bandage. But because we can't say no chain, we say we're free. At least our ancestors could see the chain and take a hammer, take some big nail and lick off the chain off our foot and our neck and our hand. Oh, we're going to take off the chain off our brain. It don't take a hammer. It don't need no chisel. So much people come and show you what to do. So much people come and die and show you what to do. I will continue with the ignorance. And most of the time, the ignorance is to our own self. 
to your own self for show that ignorance. Sometimes you hear oh a black man talk to a next black man. Him not talk to the white man them way there. Him not talk to the white man certain way you now. When you see oh black woman to themselves and to every country say it's not themselves them want to look like you know it's something where planting at the mind subliminally planting at the mind and them can't escape it because every turn them turn 360 degrees is that image that enslaved them right now for 500 years and beyond that image upon the billboard that image upon the television that image with them hear over the radio that image in a them party when them grab up all of that image them is not them again. Them last. And if one somebody come tell them, say, what that you do? You become the enemy. You become the enemy. So some people say, Muta, company where you really talk about black this and black black. You know, say black people now change. What if people say that to me, you know? You know, say them now change. Them now not change for change. I can't afford to think so. I can't afford to think so. When I remember all of the people them who come before I, I make I could have come right as so no one I say where I say. I don't feel say I had the last one to say where I say. But I know say when them did I say it, and I start to say it. I get comfortable in you know, my brains and it opens my faculty to understand and to do something to alleviate slave mentality in an African people. Because when we start out in a school, I defend black power. The young place me about black power America, you know. The young place me about black power Angela Davis, Black Panther, all of them people in America, Malcolm X, and them some there. When I hear about white supremacy, it's black people here I hear about, about white supremacy, you know. And when we hear about the Ku Klux Klan and all them people there. And now we still turn up and see them at this course. Pan big CNN, NBC, CN, all of the NC them. We see them at this course white supremacy and the threat to human dignity. We see them at this course black entrepreneurship, black possibilities in the future market. And we talk about market, you know, about yam and cocoa. When I talk about the market, they will kind of know that they did have the constitution too. You never know that. The so black people was regulated to ground provisions and fish. That all he was allowed to sell. Ground provisions and fish. Wow. Was... Now we say it move. That black people now. I sell black people sell by way of them political ideas and them banking system and them religion that make you feel like say you're free because you see a black face there they saw and don't know say it's a black man who has now become a roast breadfruit you have become a roast breadfruit. And you believe him 
because him have on a suit. You believe him because you see him in the church. You believe him because you see him in a parliament. You believe him because him suit looks so crisp. Deceive him. And him depend all the what them call them now, the, the, the societal um, organizations. We need to wake up. In the past, so much years, we must say that over a million, million, million times, we must say wake up. The world are sick. We sick, man. I mean, I talk about just sick in our head, we are talking about in our body too. Because I think it's only them head, we head them attack. They attack with body, with the food where we are eat. Most Jamaicans sick. Most of us sick and know it. Most of some of us sick and do even know so we sick. May I listen to the radio and hear them talk about diabetes. And them talk about um what them call the next one we are the uh, Catch up on people. All are we susceptible to these things? All are we susceptible to these things? We're sick. We're sick in our brains. We're sick in our body. I know them are try all sort of things. Them, them all now start to produce things where them feel say we have a use because we're into that now. You know? Remember, grandmother used to give you bush. Now they might package the bush. Package the bush. And put things in the bush. And we don't know where they put in the bush. But show we into bush now. Them just bush we. Them just bush we. It's a serious thing. Serious, serious. Serious when you look on the road and see the woman them. I say, really? Uh, that one I wear? I saw now go on. You see all this TikTok thing? Uh, the worst thing ever happened to humankind, you know, that TikTok thing there. Worst thing. Because people go say it can't do for good. So yes, everything can do for good and bad. Everything. Water. Quench your thirst. You still water, drown you. Everything that people say is bad is also have a good man man thing inside of it. So when you look at it uh, tic tac, and you see how black people are going on the tic tac. I mean, no business how white people are going on it, you know, because Chinese things. And you see how America go ban tic tac, you know. But they are ban it because they feel say them get threatened by China. Because China could have spy through them and get that information through TikTok. So them decide to watch her. The only way TikTok can operate in America, if it's a company in, a, in America, responsible for it. And we there with TikTok, TikTok, like a, like a, like a clock. TikTok. And when you look on TikTok, and when you hear TikTok, I guess you're weird. And that's how we reach us, sir. And it just spill up on YouTube, and YouTube spill up on TikTok. Because TikTok is just a shortened version of it on the YouTube. Me never feel like some other little one, something banned yet, like how I feel them things that should have banned. Because I see what it has done. I see what it has done to black people. People say every people, but yeah, make other people deal with them to problem. Black people have a problem here, so now. And TikTok and YouTube and all them something there. I create havoc in the consciousness of the people. Havoc. Just go up on YouTube and say, we are going. Man, see people are dead and instead I'm tell the person. Him grab him phone for get TikTok or YouTube. See there, 
clap. <laughs> but I, but iPhone will say, yes, that's true. It's a serious thing. Oh, we reach a stage where we see my brother at Joan or a sister at Joan or something terrible that happened to somebody who we know. And instead of you run for go save them, you run for find your phone in your car for come out for come shoot where I go on. At this age, reach. I think TikTok is a more dangerous thing than is a good thing. I don't know. What do you think? I think say TikTok more dangerous, especially to the youth them. Imagine you send your youth go to school to write it and as them get little lunch time, as them get recess time, break time, I just TikTok. You might find some little craziness for though. So all of them are learning at the class get wiped out by just how oh, 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 long lunch, how oh, lunch, one hour oh, lunch, eight hours oh, in a school. Right? You get one hour. Oh, all the things that we you learning at the seven hour oh, get wiped out with that one hour. Oh. And the thing with it is that it's so enticing that you want to go back, go find back the one way they have to look on before your class bell ring or your, your school bell ring that you have to go back. And meanwhile, you look for it. You see other things will grab you. Tick-tock. Yes. It's a weird situation we find ourselves in now. A black people may talk to. Weird thing. Hey, nobody hear that. Them have a new president in a Senegal. Remember a couple of weeks ago, I talked about how the so-called francophone countries in Africa are run out France. Louis, why them call it francophone? It's, it's France. Control it. Colonize it. Well, a whole heap of them francophone country decides say uh, them want France come out of them country. Because France has been raping the country for years and keep the people them impoverished. And then you have some little bossy slave who run the country where in cahoots with these French. So now you have some leaders now come and say, Watch out. Hey, we want to leave the country, you know, because we're not raped for too long. And I did say, that Senegal is the crown jewel of France in Africa, in West Africa there. Can you imagine if Senegal start take the stand like when Niger and Mali and all them places are take? Well, just this week, I just this week or last week, last week, Kenya. Senegal just elect the youngest prime minister president in Africa. The youngest president in Africa. Senegal, as a matter of fact, it was ironical. The brother in the jail. In the jail. And him come out back and win the election. Fatiad year old, him be fatiad. Now, I will say it again. Can you imagine? Senegal is the crown jewel of West Africa. They have a next one, they name Cote d'Ivoire or Ivory Coast. Them country that is French can't can have French no more. Can you imagine if the youth yeah, come now and say, he might take the same line like where the other one them take the other day and say, look here, yeah, Senegal is for Senegalese. We want to leave the country because we not raped the country so long. Can you imagine if the youth yeah, go do that? My gosh, man. I will see the trend that go on, you know. We see the trend that I, I, I pick up. 
Yeah, we see a trend that develop in Africa there. Where we don't know how we're going to go. But it's not a bad look. <laughs> it's a good look. But we don't know it's our go. You see, because these Europeans is conniving and scheming that we now even look upon it that way there. When them are conniving and scheming, you know, it look like the right thing them are doing. I'm going to look turn around and find, say, you don't have no roof. <laughs> I have your water gone. I your light gone. Scheming and conniving, that's what we call it. Thief. So, we have to watch it and see what's happening in Africa there. In the west part of Africa, west coast there, because it's, a, it's, not, a, it's not a bad development. It's not a bad development. Uh, you just have come from jail. As a matter of fact, the next person to who will lead the country with him, lead their jail to. So, we will see what happens. We will see what happens. Really and truly, this is the dungeons of one of those slave dungeons. This sister go inside there. And this is what she killed. Bless up, King. Blessed. Blessed. Yes. I am a regular listener to the program on IFM fan. Mm. Yes, Empress Janet calling. Okay. And yes, um, I'm so happy to get in. Yeah, man, it's a long while I haven't spoken. Yeah, there are so many topics that I can touch on tonight. So I'm going to mention them. If I can't discuss all of them, maybe somebody else will catch up on them. Yeah, right now, what one at 80, boy, it's so terrible. Well, that weird thing that you said, you know, call me about tune line up from 80 music <laughs> to play. I want to say the weird one for me listening, but me just feel like I hit first if you touch, you know. Yeah. So me, I said, boy, Asian problem is a, is a way motor. Mm. So I don't wonder if Jamaica will reach that stage there. Because uh, that must be like Jamaica, I'm uh, going another way there, but only whoop. Then can put them up together and yet he come back to certain level of of, of liability with um uh, of, of of um you know yeah, stable stable you stay but stability right that's them mm. camps you know man it's really wicked man but them say some children come here you know and they must say, take care of them yeah 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 yeah, yeah. refugees yeah muta and um impressment in earth strong up on us you know yes oh, this yes. I mean, I look to all of the elders, them, we set the thing in a Rastafariism and even the music thing. Mm. You know, I mean, that's up to me, so always the first time I start Rastafari in Jamaica. And right I know Muta, most people have locks away nowadays, but as I want to see, I want with a the locks, them call them Rasta. Yeah. Like most people have most no a lot of people have locks nowadays, it's not Rasta. Most of people people, most people have it no no Rasta. Right. And if some of them it's not even relaxed neither. So they might copy the thing and I make the thing on water down. So I yeah. feel like say a lot of people don't wear have locks, false locks. If you say they should have pay a fine to that, you know. Oh, a, <laughs> oh yeah, what do that? Yes. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I don't see that myself. Yes, so they should have paid a price for that. But oh, you yeah, I, I do that. You know, yeah, I understand. Yeah, I say that's not right, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Muta, the bleach it didn't take over the place. Bad, bad, that it, that water dog it go more and more. The bleaching cream. Yes, bleaching thing. Mm-hmm. People they know, they know themselves at all, and it come like it go more and more. Muta, what may I say? You see, you see the politics thing we're going. You know, mm-hmm. <laughs> what a joke with election with you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yes, in the parliament we are going to motor with the speaker of the house the wife of the prime minister mm. I think this is a great country of interest and everyone yeah well but it, it just happened people did that say you know but it get water down and nobody no think about it again until like a year Mark water. Golden yeah. Mark Golden go mention it again now and it on the front burner again Muta, listen to me, man. But the woman was was a deputy, you know. So from them time, they should have borrowed, you know. When we check the levels, you know. See, them should have borrowed from them time, they say she not be no deputy. Because yeah, if you are the deputy, you know, when the person gone, you know, you have got a year time to step up to the plate. 
Yeah, and them, and them, that, and that one. But them did agree, do all of them agree, so she must be there. Boy, I mean, tell him mother that is, oh, she ever talk against her husband, can never. And this lady mm-hmm. in the place, and I make sure I own a rule. And I send letter to the clerk, and the court will call long that woman did her work, that she never retire now. And I disrespect the woman. I think that, I think Miss Ole should be put in her place. And we no, want to call her place. Which place? Take out I wish she there and drop. She is supposed to be there. Okay. In the bush, she has no speaker. And we must stand up for it. That is not right. All right, mama. That's everything I've got. Everything for Alger General to go to she first. Yeah. That can't right, man. We have to stand up for the right, motor man. Yes, and I don't look up fine, so I try for you to just bring it up. Yeah, man. Give yeah, thanks, man. man. Give thanks for the yeah, tile. Yeah, look, the queen, you know, because I don't know. So yeah, all yeah, right. Everything going still, man. Best up on the safe, man. Best up to all. Yeah. Peace, so, loving people. Yeah. So yeah, you ever know. Work for the peace. The sister mentioned eight years a while ago. You know, you have a brother down there in barbecue. I give him L. And I hear a reporter ask him, so tell me something, where you get the gun from? Not him personally, but they might ask where the people them get the gun from. And I brother I show them, so you mean, we get, no, America bring the gun them on here. Yeah? America, we get the gun them from. And I just see if America down there, you know, I organize up army um, for go down there, including Jamaica, you know. I say it again, and I go say it again and again and again, you know. Hey, when name? Where the prime is? Uh, where name again? Hold this. Hey, hold this. Look here. Uh, you better pray and say, no, no, no soldier, Jamaican soldier, no go down there and get dead, you know. May I tell you that, you know. I did there, follow, 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 follow. Where well, you know, say, is America create the problem down there? You better pray, say, two soldiers will go down there and two soldiers, Jamaican police soldiers get shot. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you that. All right. So we're gonna play the Haitian music before the sister call. And music, yeah, here. Good evening. Good evening. Yeah, man, big up again. Uh, just probably two things. Muta, um, remember you I'm going on the mic. Yeah, man. Hello? Yeah, you hear me now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last week, somebody sent me something. The 10 richest politicians, Muta. Yeah, me see. Yeah, Jamaica. Me know if you see. Yeah. Yeah, I talk about 45 million US, 35 million US. Yeah. All right? But anyway, you mentioned last week, say, most of them in one of the one party. Most All of the right. man, them were, they, most of the man them were um in a, them where they where them don't want to call them the six people them. Oh the six man them were them yeah. accused of them. Yes. Them not, them most of them in a one party, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But them show something where you have a ten one them are richer so them this No, me see that one them are me see it man, me see yeah, it. But the question I'm gonna ask you no know, Muta as a well educated person. From nineteen sixty two or from after of nineteen eighty then. So how is it the question I'm gonna ask, what was these individual professional and how is it that these guys are so rich in terms of Part of five million years and the Jamaican people are um, poor and pauper. What is the secret they are doing that is not filtering to us? Or oh, 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 we explain that? Especially well, how good we are. I how I explain it now. You see, when some guys who don't have nothing, she said, them can't get a headway through any means by anything them do, and them no want to say, illegitimately thief people, rob people. They yeah. go through politics or religion. Yes. So when them get a political party for going on, and them vote say they're gonna get elected as in a parliament. Because it's easier that we there to skim off things and move things. So you find say if you do them going there with nothing. Even though they're going to black, 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 
when them are come out, you see them face look clear, clear, clear. Clear, clear, clear. And them have house at some place. And land there at some place where you have to wait. I never know that they own the land there. I rather personally own the land there. Motor, may I tell you, man. The man is wicked. I think it's not motor. Them, most of them still in the politics and I want to let go, you know. One of them from out there, St. Thomas, I think, daughter in there, son, you know. And he has as a black man. Most of them supermarket and the people can't afford something. You have to give them a little $200. Put out their sofa motor. And you say, what is it these guys are doing? And them still in there. The other one from out there used to be like him, innocent, you know, the I am the one petro job you know. I may say the money is good enough. I'm with that. For sure them safe, you know, nah, leg up for other people. They no. go food them. Still dead in a motor. But I want to tell you something, I can tell you something. Some of them have holes, you see? And I fill them holes. And them rent the government the holes. <laughs> and live in the house. <laughs> มูตาเมมูตาเมเซลมันเจเนอเรลมาอันเดมเมมาทาบอกอีติอันมาสาอีติปราบเลมเนมอบอกดูเพื่อนสมว่าไว้การนั้นสไตร์เดมพีเพีย
I'm fully Wait, Where come again with that story? There. Come again with that story. There. There's a favorite car course yeah. where they fire shot over him. I defend the police and I have a I said, Why would I have the same bag of police downtown? I mean, I tell them how serious downtown is. You serve a minibus motor and you pay the PMP them $400 for extortion. You pay the GLP $300. And a man make a couple of chips, but he never pay the money. He bust the drop down. So he deal the bus and come back. And he mm -hmm. promised you to him with a pay him, but he yeah. come back late. So the man just tell me if you ship up my bus, I'm going ship it up. And the man just take out the car seat out of the next man bus and drag out the driver. Mm -hmm. And start beat the big man with the car seat in a motor. So where the people in the motor when they go on? And it's for a Saturday, you know. Where the man do? Yeah. And they saw a police travels every minute. So where the man do? They have them camera. Some the people are behave like a business do that motor. Me, me in the seat. My seat in front of the, um, behind the bus. I say the thing, I want a revolver, trap out motor. The 38 six shooter revolver, the police use a car when they used to drive. Them Falcon and them Crown. Yeah, trap yeah, out yeah. the man, waistband motor. He said, This is not for me, man. I'm a shit. The man, I make no effort. The man can't even beat the man for about two more minutes. Then just, I think the man would have stopped beating the man motor and take up a gun and cut. The gun there, they see him in the middle of the street, downtown. You see, Ross? So, where the, where the, where the man where my beat? Where the, where the, where the, where the, where the, the man where my beat? Where the man I do them time there? Where the man get beat? Pull him out of the driver's seat. No, I know him do, but you see, when he might beat him, where my do? I'm not licking back. He might take lick motor, man. I don't yeah. turn that, you know. He might take lick with the cross seat, because the man make sure tell me if he ship up. My vehicle, but true them kind of respect me through certain things. Himself, start me I'll ship up a vehicle some more. And I'm a put on like you know, like yeah, I use pickaxe stick motor, like I catch a man, rip a all the man. I, I use a pickaxe stick back them time then. Yeah. When I said that, you tell me, I said, no, Jamaica, motor, Jamaica, not far from Haiti. All right, so tell me, yeah. tell me all that done. Tell me where we're going after that. In beat him, man, beat him, man. I think our next boss man come with me in the morning. Be in the morning and, and, and so where you where, where the brother where my beat him gone him, him, him walk away him go back here on the bus and I want to tell you too the, the person who owned the bus is that Dan uncle from t Valley too mm. maybe he was scavenged but him dead mm. eh I moved that the man the thing the man would have take up the gun and the man not look busy with the gun is like him in the bedroom, same way. <laughs> the man, I said, Mota, I said, no, this is not for me, man. No, yeah, yeah, I have to yeah. sell out Mota, man. I have to sell out. Yeah. Black people and politicians. Yeah. Because the problem with the Mota, they allow the, the, the extortion for go on, he said mm. to that control certain thing, just like how they allow the scamming. But what the scammer them do now, them take the money by a machine and when the scamming thing done now, you know, so them start, I don't know, I hold up bar with high power going to do this stuff. Them else feel kind of thing, them a business for the underworld economy. As long as it can't stop certain things, but when it, when it dry up no motor, the man never bring out the gun for us. Yeah. And at that time, you see what go on now. What, I sent Elizabeth where about six man where the bar with high power going to rob everybody. Yeah. Yeah. I have 50, 30, 40 police star poverty that blew them in a local man and harassed these and now by the so we will for, for, for collect money for Andrew. Mm. But we will want to divert. So I, I have to move, though. I have to move. I have to go call. Right. Big up to Raspar here. Big up yeah. to Kenara. All right, bless you. Young guy. Yeah, yeah, man. Big up yeah. Raspar. Land is the power. Land is the basis of the power in our IT. And then why I make you feel so why it's pure gang why. I know pure gang why just that when you have things like them, you have some little criminal activity we mix up with the one them who they are fights a real situation. So we can't kind of spread it when I say a gang war and I was send troops down there to kill our people. When you have some legitimate warriors down there, we have fight for them land. Because the American them and the French them want to keep it and hold on and it to suck out the, the land dry. I make the whole heap aristocratic and 
all of them big guys down there will own this and own that. Want we'll to keep the pigs them in poverty continuously. And you have some man down there say, no, we're not continue that, you know. So it look away. It look away because them want to make it feel like it look away. Because them are create the space to make it look away. That them will have legitimacy for going to go create a next problem on top of problem. Just like what them are doing right now. Just like what them are doing right now. In a Yemen. Them create the problem and then go like them and solve the problem. Just like how Biden I tell Netanyahu now say, well, I must ease up. Meanwhile, he must say that he must send 2,000 bomb, 2,000 pound bomb down there for bomb the people them. You can't believe that. Him tell the attack about say, Netanyahu will get out of hand. Meanwhile, they must ship bombs and modern technological advanced weapons. The people them are demonstrate against him that alone might make him lose the election. It's a serious thing. People them now ramp, the people now say, watch your body now where you deal with. Oh, you cannot do that. You know, she so said the thing get away. The man that kill people who are sending food down there for the people them. That is what Israel them are do. Uh, the, the, the IDF, them call them Israel Defense Force. So we have to watch it. We are going. We have to see say, these people don't have way in their mind and thoughts. And I want to talk about something where I want to talk about something where Aris Chang said to me down at the um and the back I going, I have to go get the tape and play it. Tomorrow I'm going to go do that. Where Aris Chang said to me down so as it cause we asked him about 80. We him touch upon the 80 thing and we asked him about it. And him give me an answer there. And I, I really want to follow up on it with the tape. Anyway, the time is 12 o'clock. As well as I talk about 80, and we are going down there. Make them, them, them want us to believe, say, it's a gang war, I go on. Not no gang war. Don't make them tell you no foolishness. I don't know where. And just send soldiers go down the far. They have to do it though, because they get bound by America. Bound. Can't do nothing outside of it. And that, that approve that. The other day, at the, at the, at the, the celebration, I, I approve it. And we have it on tape. <laughs> we have it on tape. So like black bill tape. <laughs> so like a black bill tape. Eel. Eel. Man didn't go you the one. Yeah, man. I've been trying from, to come from last week. I want to talk to you, you know. I know. I tried for a couple of times last week, but I parried and never pick up. But, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. All right. We want to yeah. come back to this thing with this boy here where I talk about him going to shoot. Him wa, when he look for a black woman. What's your name? Them feel yeah, like you, you, Muta, you said just before you said that, yeah. let me tell you, sir, I've been saying repeatedly, just like you, that Jamaican and people from the Caribbean, not to send no soldiers or police to Haiti to do the dirty work of racist U.S. imperialism. Yeah. And it is unjust choice because it's either if we of the African race or is against the African race. They might get money for you. They might get money. Yeah. America have, a, have, no, a, have, a, have a money designated for that. Yes, but that is the same seller business where some of our people of course. sold others and betrayed them. Yes. So a traitor is a traitor. So yes. anyone who take money to want uh, to... Kenya they like to. Kenya they like Kenya they like to. Yes. Who? Yeah. Yeah, yes, the boy William Roto is, yeah. is a traitor and the courts in Kenya against it because a lot of the people there have brought legal action against William Roto who used to pretend to him a Pan-Africanist but is a traitor working for the racist just like Paul Kagame in 
in, in, in Rwanda, Rwanda. etc. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, and what people in Jamaica must do is make a stand that no Jamaican soldiers or police be sent to Haiti to shed the blood of our African brothers and sisters, boys and girls in Haiti. Or people have to take a stand concretely. Well, you, you don't want to take a stand now. You don't want to take a stand. If, two, yes. if some soldiers go along there and two Jamaican soldiers get shot, that is when they're going to take a stand. After the thing, yes. after, you know. They, they, after, them not do after things. The thing. Yeah, before, them do it after. Mm. So you better is, make sure so none of them not stupid. get shot. Yeah, which is stupid because it should be preventative. Of course. It's supposed of to course. be due to yeah. help the racist US, the thief, continue to try and teeth Real. resources of hate and against like African people. So them all send rice there with arsenic in it after they destroy it is self-sufficient rice industry. Yeah, yeah, remember the lamb from France. They send um, cholera yeah. to the Haitian yeah. people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, River water and kill no for we people and yeah. no compensation. Yes, none of that, none of that, you know, and thing. So, so yes. want to talk about this brother? Yeah. Yes, um, this is a boy Frank Hester, OBE, yeah. founder owner of the Phoenix Partnership, which he founded as sole owner and chief executive officer in 1997. From Lee. Yeah. 66, he's 58 years old. How and much he is a size computer. Eh? How much year old he is? 58. He was born in oh. 1966. He's okay. 58 years old. Yeah. And he supply computer systems to thing. And this is why people are saying that um, Jamaica should annul that contract that team have with some, I, I think it's Mapen Hospital in Clarendon. Yeah, it's your data, it's your data, it's your, it's your medical data, they must store. Yeah, 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 yes, yes, because they supply computer systems. Yeah. You know, they supply computer systems. And what he actually said uh, is that when he see Diane Abbott on TV and etc., it make him want to hate all black women and she should be shot. Yeah. Simple. What a thing. What a thing. Yes. Plain. You don't have it plainer than that. And Richie Sunak and others were trying to defend him. Yeah. About yes, him rude, but it not racist and so. Of course it is racist. For you to say that when you see Diane Abbott on TV, um, it makes you want to eat all black women, meaning African women. And, no and she should be shot. And she should be rat shot. That yeah. is racist. That is more than being rude. He must you suggest that she should, have been, should have get murdered. Yeah, yes, yes, and she should be shot. Yes. So that's incitement between you make it was one of our people who said something wow. similar. Hey, what did that mean? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Uh, racist, racist. But, and you know, him give them 10 billion um, the tourists. Pound. 10 billion pounds. He give them 10 billion pounds, yes. So but him say, it, 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 somebody bought out and said he's not a racist because him do business in Jamaica. Yes. But so we, that, we, that, we, we, we put it this way. The, the racist enslavers in Jamaica who enslaved our ancestors, they were doing business in Jamaica. They were doing business in Jamaica. Yes, enslaving, raping, and murdering our people. Yes, yeah. yes. That is, they were doing genocidal Holocaust business in Jamaica and the rest of the Caribbean and in Mother Africa. Because it's from Mother Africa that they devastated first, capture and enslave our people, why they and brought some of our ancestors to the Caribbean and elsewhere, to the what is now called the States and so. Uh, 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 and have and been in chattel enslavement. Yes, they were really doing business. Evil, genocidal business and so on. And you know, Muta, um, some of the legends in J 
Jamaican music passed away recently, you know. You had um, Sir Christopher, who was born in Spanish Town. He, he um great soul system man from Birmingham when he came here, you know. He passed away um, recently. La- last week I was playing at his after funeral, you know, in Birmingham uh-huh. with Quaker City Soul and Lady Cox and so on, you know. And massive funeral on Wednesday the 27th of March, you know, and, uh-huh. and, and thing. Massive, massive. Um, Sir, 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 Sir Christopher, you know, man who was born 11th of December 1942 and passed away on the 11th of January 2024. And then one of the most famous clubs in London, founded by man from Blackwoods, Clarendon, Jeffrey Palmer, who is the elder brother of the two brothers who are Jetstar Records and so on. He passed away um, recently also, and it was there was a funeral service for him on Tuesday, the 2nd of April, mm. at the church in Wembley, St. Michael's Church in Wembley. But his body is going to be repatriated to Jamaica, where there will be a burial in Man- Manchester. He owned the famous London Apollo Club in Wilsden, Jeffrey Palmer, you know? I'm not related to Mr. Palmer. Just eh? Sir Palmer. I'm related to Mr. Palmer. Yes, man. He's the eld, he's the eld. Oh, yeah, yeah, you see that now. Hold on, I'm going to take a break and come for I'm going to take a break. Yeah, man. You there, eh? Yeah, me there, me there. Yeah, all right. When we want to find out, how oh, oh, the black people I'm in, a, in a England... I deal with deal with this thing. Uh. It's, it's just that him say it and it done away with. Uh, and the and the organization no. up there, what? where women organize, no. black what woman that? organization, I take a stand. Or oh, oh, go, where well, go on? What happened is that when he did it, there was an uproar from the African community in 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 Britain, and there was a supportive meeting for Diana Abbott about it at the Hackney Town Hall, which is in our constituency. You know, very big turnout there in March and so on. And people are continuing to say that um, he, he must be prosecuted for inciting right. racism, um, hatred, and that type of thing. And for um, to say that Diane Abbott should be shot and so on, that he should, charges should be brought against him for incitement to murder Diane Abbott. So, so the Prime Minister not said nothing. The Prime Minister not said nothing about it. Yes, he, he, he had said at first he was keeping silent, but then because of the pressure from us as African people and so on, he was forced to say something, and he was saying at first that he says rude but not racist and so on, and we take him to task about that that it is racist. It's yeah. not. It's more than rude. It is racist and something like that. It, 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 this the money should be returned that him donated to the party, and also he should be charged in the court for yeah. um for, for, for racist incitement for murder. Incitement yes. for murder. Yes, of course. Yes, which 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 is, which is what it is. You see, so. And, and as I said, there was a meeting at the town hall and Diana, but of course was there and so on, and support. And the thing about it is that even people in our community who don't dig Diana, but for certain things, yeah. supported her, uh, but, not but because they supported Diana, but, but an, that attack on her is an attack on all Africans Black woman, in yes. the country. Yes, yeah. whether male or female. Because yeah, I have my protection. disagreements with her. Seriously, but this is an attack on all of us. This is well, not just on Diana, but the individual, you know. So yeah. we're not letting that go away. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, what's the way that no, we are not. You know. And by the way, Jeffrey Palmer, um, on Tuesday the second, he was the eldest of the Palmer brothers from Blackwoods near Moko in Clarendon. You know. Yeah, he sent right. for the other two. Yeah. He sent for um, Harry, 
who is a pastor has his own church in Mandeville, and that's where the church service is going to be held. Okay. You know, and burial after on the 20th of April. But on the, um, he sent for Harry and the younger brother, Carlisle, because there were six of them, you know, yeah. um, three boys and three girls. Do and, you know, know. Know. and what happened is that um, one of the things that the Palmer brothers did, he said he had a club called the 31 Club, 31 Hillside in Stonebridge, London, North West End, and then moved in the early 70s, about 7071, to the London Apollo Club, and I was one of the first persons who used to go to that club. And all top artists used to perform there. You know, Betty Wright, um, Gladys Knight and the Pips, um, Johnny Nash, Alton Ellis, Bob Marley, Ken Booth, Errol Dunkley, you name it. Yeah, all yeah, of the yeah. top artists, the London Apollo Club, man. Mm. World, world famous, like Count Suckles, um Q Club there in... Great Street that used to do the same thing. Mela so, tell you, say Duke BSC don't Duke BSC in Jamaica. Who? Duke, Duke BSC, him there. Okay, all right. Heal him up for me. Heal yeah. him up for me. You know? yeah, and, and, but guess what happened to? The same Tuesday here, 2nd of um, April, that there was a funeral service, as I said at the St. Michael's Church in Wembley and, you know, I was one of the Paul bearers. Is the same day that the great Bibi Seaton, one of our great... Pass away, yeah. Writers, you know? okay. It was his cremation service on the same day. Yeah. So, yeah, I was yes. unable, you know, it can't be two places at the same time, but, um, <laughs> but, and I played music at the afters for Jeffrey Palmer. You know, was well attended and and so on. Yeah, yeah. But um, I saw Bibi Seaton's um, daughter, Venetia, from Wildman Street, Central Kingston, originally, and her son, and a son of his, car, you know, called Wayne, and um, and another daughter of his, because he had six children, you know, yeah, and yeah. also Venetia's um, mother, Jeanette. His first wife, who used to go to Campadon High School. Mm. Yes. You know? And, right. and, and, and King. So, those two were on Tuesday, the um, 2nd of, of April. And, and, and. I have to so, move now. I have to move. Yeah. Jeffrey Palmer was 88, by the way. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, man. You, you, you know? And so on. So you know what come at Jamaica tomorrow? Fight. You know what? Well, today, the daughter we used to oh. sing with Wheelers. What's your name again? Cherry Kelso. Yes, she'll come and join me tomorrow. Beverly Kelso. Beverly Kelso. Yes, she'll come and join me tomorrow. Oh, so, because she was there the other day too, not you? I never, I don't know, but someone from Long Island. Yeah, yes, man. She was, uh, yeah, man. No, she was in Jamaica some months ago, man, because, yeah. right, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And, and she do only survive in Wheeler. Wheeler, yeah. All right, we have to move, though. Yeah, Beverly Kelso. Yeah, keep move. strong and yeah. no Jamaican troops in Haiti. None yeah. of that. All right, sir. Keep the fight. Keep the fire burning, motor. Uh, of course. No Jamaican troops and police to go there for help racist U.S. to murder our people in Haiti. And there's no gangs in Haiti, as me and you know. Yeah. The people fighting for them country. See? We have to move. We have to move, though. I have to get cut off. Right. We don't want to cut you off. I A freedom fighter. Barbecue is fighting the oligarch, the rich, because of what the rich been doing in Haiti for the past 50, 50, 60 years. That's his mission. His mission is to, this is one thing he said. He said, I don't have a problem with you come here getting rich. However, those rich, not, they don't be not one hospital, not one school. Deacon Malachi, welcome. I never knew TV. Good to it. I'm glad to be here. My name is Deacon Malachi. I'm glad to be here. All right, serious thing. Um, I want to get right into it, right? Can you please just give us a brief history of America's role in Haiti? Okay. Uh, for those of you who don't know, we have a chance to uh, 
take a trip to Haiti uh, uh, a year and a half ago, two years now. Uh, the brief is so is this. As you guys know, the, 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 first, the, the president that the people ever vote for was Aristide. Aristide. Everybody else is people just America, France, Canada is behind. Uh, you got Haiti been controlled by, for the past 60 years, by maybe about what? 10 to 12 families. And those guys then cohook with America, France, and Canada to make sure Haiti stay where it is, to make sure Haiti stay poor, Haiti stay in poverty, uh, to make sure that the, the countries not move, don't move forward. So why, they, why they take the resource out of the country? That's, that's been going on for years now, for years, for years. And uh, if you, I don't know if you know, when you, look, when you look at Haiti and America, Haiti is not even two hours from, from Florida, Miami. Haiti is not even two hours from America. So basically, Haiti is in the backyard of America. If America really wanted to help Haiti, they would do it already. But it's not about that. They want the country to stay like that. They want the country to stay poor while they're robbing the people, while they're robbing the resources. And that's been going on for, for the past 50, 55 years. I hear a lot of people speaking about the resources being stolen from Haiti. What are some of the resources that these countries are taking from Haiti? I want to name you a couple. Uh, Haiti got bauxite, Haiti got copper, Haiti got gold. The gold of Haiti alone is worth $20 billion. Haiti got uh, marble, oil, uh, natural gas. Haiti got, there's something called I I iridium. Iridium is, is a very, very rare uh, 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 something. It's only Haiti and South Africa who got it. And America been taking that out of Haiti for a long time. So that, that alone, that's telling you that why they make sure the country never, the country stay poor, the country dis, they put dis, they destabilize so they can take the, the resource of the country. All right. Um, I know we spoke previously, right, and you were telling me about the role of the elite in destabilizing Haiti, right? Please tell me about the emergence of Mr. Barbecue. Okay. Barbecue. I had a chance to, a couple of years ago, years ago, because you've been two years now, I had a chance to actually sit down with barbecue. Before, before I start talking barbecue, I want to say this, to, especially to the Haitians diaspora. Stop listening to the news. They're not telling you the whole truth. I had a chance to sit with them and myself. Barbecue is nothing what the news say is. Nothing. I'm telling you that right now. Nothing. Barbecue is what you call a freedom fighter. Barbecue is fighting the oligarch, the rich, because of what the rich been doing in Haiti for the past 50, 50, 60 years. That's his mission. His mission is to... This is one thing he said. He said, I don't have a problem with you come here getting rich. However, those rich... Not, they don't be not one hospital, not one school. Remember, when you look at history, every single leader who ever stand up for the people, what they do, they always put a name on them. So it make no difference. Uh, uh, they say, oh, he's a gang. Listen, barbecue is no different than Martin Luther King, who was fighting for his people. He's no different than Malcolm X. He's fighting for his people, and and he's got the right to fight for his people. So. He's nothing what they say he is. Barbecue is a rev revolutionary. He's f and he understand he's fighting some of the most powerful people. People got with women. He actually understand that he might get killed. But he understand it's okay at least if he get killed, he get killed for his people. All right. Uh, where does he get ammunition from? <sighs> That's a good question. So now, the last time I looked, Haiti don't make no weapon. Haiti don't make no gun. Haiti don't make no bullets, right? So how is this weapon, how is this ammunition getting the country? The rich, the oligarch, they provide this weapon to those so-called gun leaders to destabilize the country so they can rob the resource out of Haiti while the population is not paying attention. So what, what they, the region count on, they didn't count barbecue 
united the united the so-called gang against them. Those are the same weapon. Where does weapon come from? They come from America. That's where they come from. To put destruction to kill the people while they were up the country. That's where the, that's where those guns come from. America. America is let me tell something. Everything which happening here right now, America first and Canada's behind it. Don't let nobody fool you. Don't let nobody fool you. How did how was he able to unite the gangs? Well, when I when I was talking to him, one of the things he said, he said, You gotta understand. A man who's not educated, the, when 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 he cannot feed his family, the first thing he's gonna do what? He's gonna pick up a gun. Right? So what you see in Haiti right now is people who've been struggling to feed their family, to feed their children for a long, long time. When the chance for them to rise up, find a way to uh, 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 kidnap, do all the, the uh, uh, murder, the, now you provide a gun for them, what you think they're going to do? So Barbecue said, listen, he understand these men, a lot of them is men of lack of education. They're not, they, they cannot think straight. In other words, they cannot think of the people. So what he did is he said, you know what? Let me see if I can unite them together. Because at the end of the day, they all fight for the same thing. That's how he was able to unite them. They all fight for the same thing. They fight what? They fight against the rich. They fight against the oppressor that's come in their country. Now think about it. They got all their resource in their country. But outsiders come in and take the resource. And they didn't do nothing for the country. So, for example, let me give you an example. I got a couple of names. You got, uh, for the past 60 years, right, you got the so-called, the, the oligarch in Haiti, right? They said they're Haitian. They're not. They're not. They are the so-called Jews. They're not Haitians. Those, those 12 families, 14 families control Haiti, they are not Haitian. I want to make that clear. They're not Haitian. People thinking because they got a Haitian passport, they're Haitian. Because they got a Haitian birth certificate, they Haitian. No. Anybody can get, as a matter of fact, anybody can get any passport as long as you got money to pay for it. Anybody can get a birth certificate as long as you got money to pay for it. Because you got a birth certificate from here, that doesn't mean you're Haitian. Yes, they might have a birth certificate, they might have a passport, they're not Haitian. Those people, they are what you call Amalek. The Bible call them Amalek. They are the so-called Jews today. That's them. You got families like uh, uh, Abdallah. You see that name? I remember that name when I was a kid growing up in Haiti. This family been control Haiti for a long time, bro. You got family like Abdallah. You got, you got Cars Bono. You got Regino Bulos. Bulos on one of the biggest hotels in Haiti. And those are hotels that a regular Haitian will never, will never stay in. I know because we went to Haiti. We see the hotel. You know what I'm saying? You got those families. You got, uh, uh, Gregory Mays, you got uh, uh, Brent, you got B, uh, uh, Bigino, you got Antoine Accra. That's another name, Accra. Those guys run the country. And those guys make sure the people stay in poverty. Those guys make sure there's always, always chaos in the country. I'm going to give you an example. The president who just got murdered, Joseph De Moise. Do you know those guys who don't want to put him in power? Now he turned against them. What did they do? They kill him. When, once he said, hey, listen, your guys who have the country too much, at least let the people have a little bit, they say, no, 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 no. They kill them. Those guys, they are in Kowut with the United States of America to make sure Haiti staying destabilized. That's how Barbecue was able to unite the gang because the gang is not stupid. They can see who's actually taking all the resources, who actually the people is in poverty. They can see it. They're not stupid. Uh, quick question. When these international companies come are they using haitians for labor or are they bringing outside people for the labor they use haitian for labor they use haitian for labor i don't know if you know uh i just uh, uh i was just reading an article a couple of days ago uh you ever heard of Le levi's Le levi the, the company Le who made levi's jeans you ever heard of hens there was a situation in haiti where Right now, America got what, what, 32,000 workers, companies in America got 32,000 Haitian workers making their stuff from Haiti. 
there was a situation in Haiti where they was getting 23 cents an hour. They rise up to say, you say they want to raise. They want to raise it, what, 263 cents. Guess who come against them? Obama. Obama fought the Haitian not to get 63 cents an hour. 63 cents an hour. While you got companies like Hands, you got companies like Levi's Jeans, who's making billion dollars a year. But they don't want to pay 65 cents an hour. Now, if you go to any store, a Levi jeans is what? $75? $80? But, but the people who make that, the people who make them, you don't want to pay them. Guess what? It's not only in Haiti, bro. They're doing the same thing. Right now, in DR Congo, you see that world going in DR Congo right now? What? Seven million hourly die? They're doing the same thing. They're doing the same thing all over Africa. They're, they're doing the same exact thing. It's not only in Haiti. That's what America, France, the European countries, Canada, that's what they do. They keep the people in poverty. All right. Um, you also told me about a conversation you had with Barbecue that really impressed you. Uh, let the viewers know what he told you when you, uh, he asked you, when you asked him what he needed for help. So after we interview him, we sit down, we talk to him. He worked with us in the neighborhood. He showed us how the people live in poverty. And he was asking, he said, he don't even know how these people survive. That's how bad it was. So after the camera turned off, I went in the corner with him. I said, barbecue, let me ask you a question. This is just a personal question between me and you. I said, what do you need from us? What do you need, what do you need from us as for help? He said, can you guys help me send a couple of kids to school? Now, you, you, now, a man like that, you're telling me he's a gang leader? He said, I was, I was shocked. He, he actually said that. He said, do you, have a, do you guys have access to pen, paper, uh, book bags, notebooks? He said, I got a lot of kids here that they cannot, they can, their family cannot provide this stuff. He said, if you, can, if you guys can help me just send a couple of kids to school, I would appreciate it. He didn't ask for money. He didn't ask for a gun. He didn't ask for a bullet. He said, help me send the kids in the neighborhood to school. He said, as you guys walking, you see a bunch of kids not going to school. He said, because they can't afford it. So you going to say no to a man like that? He didn't ask for nothing else. You going to say no to him? And you, now you try to tell me, these guys, that's why I said to your, to your, your Haitian in the diaspora, don't believe everything the news tell you. Those are the things the news will never tell you. All right, so clarify the violence going on in Haiti now, right? I know what the media says. What do you understand? Who is the victim of the violence in regards to citizens can, in Haiti? Before you move, can I move? Can I read the scripture? Go ahead, go ahead. I want to read the scripture. Because, because we've been talking about uh, uh, the resource. We've been talking about... Uh, I want to read the scripture quick in Deuteronomy 28 right quick. I'm going to show you. The Haitians, the so-called Haitians, because that's not really their name. God call them Levi. That's the name. Uh, for you, for you, uh, the diaspora, the uh, uh, so-called Haitians who listen right now, uh, you, your biblical name is Levi. That's how. That's who we are. And I'm gonna show you something, right? This is what God said. Because before Moses died, Moses, we was the one Moses. God sent Moses in Egypt to deliver out of Egypt and slavery. Before Moses died, Moses said this to us. I want to show what Moses said. And we see it right now. When you look at Deuteronomy 28, right quick, right? Uh, verse 33. It said, the fruit of thy land. What is the fruit of, thy, of our land? Right now you got all the resources. You got all the, everything I just mentioned before that, right? Those, those, you said, the fruit of thy land and all thy labor shall a nation which thou knows not eat up. It's not the Haitian people who's, who's uh, prosper from, the, from all the resources. It's other nation. Those people I just mentioned, those 12 families who control Haiti. Those people, who, which is who call the so-called Jews. They're the ones who who's, who's, uh, 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 take with these resources. They're the ones who's, who's uh, 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 what is what I'm looking for? Who's eating out of those resources. It's not the Haitian people. Now he said, listen what he said. He said, shall a nation which thou know not eat up, and thou shalt be only oppressed and crushed always. What is he talking about? That's, 
that's 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 one of the colonizers. How long? Hey, listen, when you what you say here right now is real real oppression, bro. Real oppression. So I just want to read that to show you that we are the Israelite, that the so-called Haitian, they are the tribe of Levi. Because what I just read, that's exactly what's going on in Haiti right now. They're taking the resources, the people's in poverty. You say you got another question. What was it? Oh, yeah. I wanted to get back in regards to the media talks about a lot of violence going on, right? So who is the target of the violence of Barbecue and his crew? Or is that true? You say the target of the violence? Yeah. Who is Who is... They speak about a lot of violence going on in Haiti, uh -huh. right? Who is... Who is receiving, who is the violence towards? It doesn't seem like okay. it's towards the upper class. It seems like average citizens are being victims of violence. Okay. I'm going, let's talk about the police force in Haiti. The rich control the police force in Haiti. For example, if you look at the, the guy who's the chief of police, he, he, he get paid by those guys. So now. Real quick, do they still have the private police that was there with Papa Doc or no? No. They're done? Mm -mm. I was still, what was I the was, name? Oh, Tonto Maku. Tonto <laughs> Maku, yeah, 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 crazy. All right, go ahead. Tonto Maku. Oh, that's been gone. All right, cool, cool. So, so you live in a country, right? The oligarch, they control the police force. They pay the police force. They, 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 they do what you call a, 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 pay them to do what they wanted. So those same guys, they're the one right now who stand against barbecue. Oh, so the, the 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 fighting is not really the citizens; it's the police no. force against barbecue. Exactly. All right. That's what I said. Do not believe the media. Don't believe the media. The media wants you to believe barbecue targeting citizen. That's not true. Regular people. That's not true. Think about it. Think about it. Think about it. Think about it. Where barbecue is at, barbecue control what six, nine, ten blocks. If he really targeting the people, how come they didn't kill him yet? How come the people didn't rise up against him yet? That's what the media is not telling you. It's not the people who are with barbecue. It's the, pol the same police force that those guys that get paid by those oligarchs to kill the people, they're the one who stand against barbecue. They're the one who stand in the so-called gang. But don't let the media fool you. Barbecue didn't target nobody. Another thing he said, he said, when I was with him, we were sitting down and there was a, there was a young, uh, young woman who... Uh, who said, hey, Bobby, you cannot talk to you for a minute. And I overheard him, I overheard her say, hey, I need to go to school. I don't have no money. And he said to her, well, you're supposed to bring me the paperwork for the school to tell me how much it costs so I can pay. I'm not giving you the money if you don't bring me the paper. So he said, if I give you the money, you're going to waste it. I want to make sure you go to school. So when I asked him about that, he said, it's not only her. Every single young lady is around here, young men, he was responsible for them. He said, one thing I would not allow if somebody come around and rape them, do anything bad to them. Because a lot of them don't have no father. He said, I'm their father. While I'm walking to the guy, he's going into his pocket, give people money to go eat food. And you want me to believe that's a gang leader? You want me to believe he's killing the people? That's not true. All right. Question I have, right, is like, how does barbecue get his funding, right? And I just think, oh, please explain. That's a good question. How does he get his funding? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. But somebody's funding him. That's, I'm just trying to figure out. Oops. <laughs> barbecue is what you call. Oops, 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 oops. One thing I would not allow if somebody come around and rape, rape them, do anything bad to them. Because a lot of them don't have no father. He say, I'm their father. While I'm walking to the guy, he's going into his pocket, give people money to go eat food. And you want me to believe that's a gang leader? You want me to believe he's killing the people? That's not true. All right. Question I have, right, is like, how does barbecue get his funding, right? And I just think, oh, please explain. That's a good question. How does he get his funding? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But somebody's funding him. I'm just trying to figure out like the execution because um, it seems as if he's moving towards a, a revolution in Haiti, right? That's, that's his, exactly what we need. That's his main goal. That's his main but goal, yes. The question I have now is that like how can this be successful without strong funding from an outside force? 
That's what I'm trying to you're analyze. Never gonna, you're never going to find yeah, out yeah. who's funding him. Yeah. But one thing I do, I do agree. We do need a second revolution in Haiti. We do. Because these people who come and rob the people, spoil the people, kill the people, oppressing the people, somebody needs to do something about that. And that's where he come in. But you will never find out who's funding them. Barbecue is well funded. You want me to believe a gang leader is well funded? Bar Listen, as, 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 as far as I know, Barbecue never raped nobody. He never kidnapped nobody. He never murdered nobody. So, so somebody is funded him. I don't know. But I know he well funded. He well funded. They wanna, when they show him in the camera, they want to show all these guys with him. They look dolly and everything. That's not true. They're well equipped. Look, you see the type of guns these guys carry? I will think about it, right? Haiti, suppose this is supposed to be a poor country, right? You got a guy, they show you, you got a guy who carry a $3,000 weapon. Where the hell he got the money to, to buy that weapon? But Haiti is supposed, supposed to be a poor country, right? Where these weapons, how do you get that weapon? Where that weapon come from? How do you get the bullet to put in that weapon? Where that bullet come from? Somebody providing that guy with those weapons. Somebody is funding that guy. Where, now, the question is, where is barbecue find money to feed all these people? Yeah. Somebody's funding him, right? Yeah. But he's supposed to be a gang leader? That makes no sense. Yes. May I tell you? Why didn't I do a good interview? Whatever. <laughs> Linda, tomorrow I hear some play interview. Linda, do a good interview. Trust me. That is an insight into another side of the story that we wanted to present to you, another side. Because we are listening to them people, they too much. You buy America, we know why yet. And them do the most exploitation on earth. You buy America, we know why yet. That terrible thing. Watch the media, you know. Watch the media. Yes, yeah. Yeah. After four, I move to Baroka. Blessed man. Long strongly. Um, I see this thing I'm going to end up to. Eh? In a high, in a high today. Yeah. What's about it? People need to stand up and, and, and strong up. They do it. You don't need to give them in a car. If them give them, it's going to look like the bookman and the man that work with them going with. That will go in things. And we don't want that to go on. So we ask people them to just stand up for them right, live up for them right, and I find them right over there. Mm. No matter what the cost. God knows it can be too, too long from now or as far as it couldn't be forever. But someday, people have to be free all over the world. Black people every, everywhere. And every nation who has love and identity have to be free. So no matter when them come with them gun and them being it and them thing, they don't think they can't solve the problem. Kill people don't have to solve the problem because the problem still remains. I just love and identity with, with, with the, the liberty of all. With a black, with a white, with a red, with a brown, with a pink, no matter who, who. I love our rule of earth, man. That I will stand favor. And on the material things and the money, I live it amongst ones and ones and ones and ones. So we ask them to just stay strong in themselves and just know so what I will stand with. We have to right. get stronger, strong. Yeah, man, and move, and move the stumbling barriers to them out of the Yes, man. Well, I want to ask you like something. Well, I'm to oh. Etana. What do you mean, I'm to Etana? I'm not sure. I'm not sure, man. You know, you know, see, I'm not sure. You know, see, I'm not sure. Yeah, but I'm not sure. Like, 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 uh, like, uh, bleach out, man, my daughter. Oh, I don't know about that. Oh, my. Beautiful black man, I'm used to see, man. Mm. What? In your in your eyes, she bleach. Yeah, man. Oh yeah, I don't know. yeah, I'm man. I man. Mm. Yeah. I don't know. I never see her near up. 
Yeah, I think I'll bring her on the stage, I'll uh, uh, rebel salute to her, and I'll see her near up. Yeah, man. I don't think she bleach. Yeah, and, 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 unless, 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 why you look, why you look, Brad Miguel and Roland family, them stay here, you know, man. All right. Really? Yeah. So, you want to stay strong and live it strong and everything strong. Yeah, man. Really? Yes, hell. Motor. Yeah, blessed man. Blessed night, Motor. Blessed mm-hmm. morning. Morning, sir. You know, Motor, um, from when I get to chance, I listen to you from the radio and some time, I cannot listen to them near the radio and can't get up on the internet, but I said, I'll give you one call in the morning. I still bought the word mm-hmm. thing. I'm going to Palestine. They come in the room. No subject where they're putting in the morning. Any subject you want to put with them on it, man? The hypocrisy where I'm going to Palestine, the atrocity, the genocide. Mm. We're going over there. You tell me about it or you ask me about it? Um, I'm mean, not going to tell you about it because you know about it, don't mm. you? You know where I'm going? Yeah. But enough people don't really understand, so. Which part of yeah. them? Tell me what they don't understand. They don't understand based on this, based on this society where we're growing a motor. We're no, what they don't understand? What they don't understand? They don't understand, say, um, what Israel do is, is, is not right in a, in a human right. They don't feel like you're right in a, in a religious way. See what I say? Okay. Yeah. But I can't tell people still, say, just come out of that really just be- believe there. And just open your eye and see what's going on in front mm-hmm. earth. You understand, because we, we live in a different time, you know, now 2024. Yeah. And we have, we have human rights and all these things. So, based on what I talk to some people in you know, Jamaica streets, you know where most, uh, most people believe in uh, Jews and believe in a uh, Christian world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And most of them are saying, yes, the more wicked people, and God chose the people, them, you know, the <laughs> part, the most of them people, them Look at, at that, the past, and tell them at Sunday time, you know. Yeah. The past, and tell them that at Sunday time, say, the people, them, we have bomb up and a murder the people, them, a God chosen people. So, mm-hmm. them, who are them? Them are who know who has said that? Who has said that? Them are what kind of people? People are telling me that. No, <laughs> man, I mean, the people, them, who are say. Them people, they are God chosen people. Mm-hmm. Who them is? Them are not chosen people, too. No, sir. Mm-mm. Them mm-hmm. I want to go back to when they were chosen. Because them I want to make a sacrifice. Mm. Um, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I know, I mean, I call a couple of times, I mean, I don't really remember, but I born and grown a Christian woman, I tell the evangelistic woman. Yeah. And the same, them same argument, them people, they must say eye to eye. Mm. You understand because then don't be in wash you don't have a stern and of just give thanks to me I want them the person who can just know say no matter even though my band and go in night mm. we can't see you wrong in night. Of course. You understand? Cause you can't tell me say you have to go annihilate people just to get your promised land. But I don't feel them land. But I don't feel them land. Who promised them it? Who promised them the land? Their ego. <laughs> and they ego and they write in their book because it's all about the colonial um the colonial um ideal and the colonial project. Yeah. Because re- remember, them claims they not own the democracy down in a, in a the Middle East, which the president na Iran have a vote for him. The president na Jordan have a vote for him, likewise Turkey and then place there. You see, so oh, oh, can you tell people say over oh, democracy when other people do the same thing for, for bring their leader? No, well, Iran, Iran, are not the democracy, you know. Yeah, but they have election. Yeah, but Iran are theocracy. Mm-hmm. Theocracy, that that's not that's not democracy. So you not call Russia when run election over there? Russia, Russia, Russia I, I talk with that. Okay. Or what you call dictator, but since a one man around the whole thing, I talk with him by himself. 
But reason we didn't know more more clarify enough things. If election in America, Jamaica, it was not Iran and it was not in a in Yeah, a, but that no means that because them are running election, all of them are the same kind of government. Okay. It no means say uh, because them have election in a Cuba, them have election in a mm -hmm. Barbados. It no means say uh, them because them are running election, them are the same thing. You have autocracy. Yeah. You have theocracy. You have communism. Autocracy. You have, yeah, uh, uh, autocracy means say uh, one man does decide yeah. everything. Uh -huh. One man. Theocracy is where they say God rule. Mm -hmm. But the rule of them who say God rule, as some man sit down and say that, mm -hmm. like how man say God write the Bible. As some man sit down and say that, say God write the Bible. Muta. Yes. If you're a student, could I tell my mother, you know, I don't want to talk about international radio for people feel like me, I disrespect my mother, you know. But you know, fanatic, I Fanatic? And, yeah, fanatic, a Christian fanatic, a, a Rasta fanatic, a, a yeah, 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 yeah. Muslim fanatic. Yeah, yeah. You understand? I mean, my mother, one of them. And when me tell my, when me and my mother are reason, for certain levels, I say, Mommy, Remember, all concept of everything where you learn, where you can teach me, or, or me see, where you want to see, how you want to see, is the whole concept of mankind. Because when me check how me go and uh, all uh, through the Bible, a uh, one man alone got to really talk to and give something. And it will be Moses. We have, to, we have to take a break and come forward. Hold on there, hold on the Virgin. Oh, yes, Virgin. Yes. As me I say, when me and my mom are really done anything, they understand. Yeah. Me tell her, say, Mom, remember the whole concept of everything was made by a man. The only man alone me can recall I can't to where them teach me in the Bible, me learn my Bible. Where God did not really talk to personally and give something personally. And it's Moses, where he saying, give me ten commandments. I'm saying, Mommy, why do the Ten Commandments when you, when you see people in the way, in feel like they're not the right? In, in this try before people them see it. So it's not a, something when you could assure people, I'm saying, see it, they can destroy it. It's a reality where they teach you in the Bible, according to them story. Mm. You understand that I can't feed them story in this try tablet with the Ten Commandments. Then you tell them what the commandments. And I say, Mom, what if? We intel we never did any commandment because my mom was trying to rock when we talk to Iraq. So I do more than one thing. I um, can share it where God would have wanted him to do a card in Christ to the Bible. You know what I say? Yeah, yeah, man. I read it too. I read it too. Yes, and I say, Mommy, me can't use them things and then just say, come tell about where, where Satan is who talk about Amalek. And then thing the way you are going, you know, 2024, you are going to invoke, 2023, 2024, you are going to invoke something like them, something like, I can't perform the story where, then the people, they look different from we, them not have no genetical, um, connection, connection to the land. So they not have it, they, they, they have that reality, and anybody at your voice, them can go check it, they cannot do no DNA to check out anybody. We come from down at the part where they say they are Zionist. I have no problem with Jews. Can't tell them, Muta. People believe what they want to believe. They believe is they believe. And check Jews, I can't hear real Judaism. They might wait for the Messiah, and they're supposed to wait for the Messiah. But them people call themselves um, Zionists, which infiltrate themselves when you about Zionist Christian and Zionist um, evangelistic Christian. These radical people where, 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 where I support genocide because this land is supposed to be free them. I mean, the more that, the more that I choose us and the more that crazy and everything is going against human rights, the Geneva Con Convention, the Genocide Convention, all of them, so them are going against it. But because they claim to them are God chosen people, them can do what them are doing right now. Yeah, yeah, black people up here, I defend them, say them are God chosen people. Yeah, because they were brainwashed. 
Remember, you know, the most programmed people in the world to me in the moment are black people, you know. Yeah. Because black people welcome everybody and everybody no welcome them. Yeah. Even them no ex even them no welcome their own self. In which for instance, me no welcome you as a black man and, and you no welcome me as a black man. But we we welcome a Jew, we welcome a Muslim, we welcome a, a European, we welcome a, a American. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I have to move though, it's somebody's attack. All right, all right, Muta. Big up yourself and big up Jamaica. Just one love, Muta. Yeah, man, I agree. All right, all right Muta. The Palestinian struggle is not just a cry for justice. It's a blistering battle for the most fundamental human rights that every living soul on this planet should inherit by birthright. It's an unyielding resistance against the oppressive, suffocating grip of occupation and the callous denial of the most basic human dignity. Just as the civil rights movement in the United States fought against the chains of racial discrimination, so too do the Palestinian people strive to shatter the chains of occupation and tyranny. Never forget, my friends, that the Palestinians, much like African Americans in the United States, have been subjected to a heart-wrenching history of suffering and torment. The birth of Israel in 1948 brought forth the mass expulsion and dispossession of hundreds of thousands of Palestinians from their ancestral homes and land. This is a historic injustice that continues to haunt the lives of to this very day. The situation in Palestine serves as a brutal reminder of the consequences of colonialism and the ruthless dispossession of indigenous people. It is an agonizing reminder that the fight for justice knows no borders and we must stand united in solidarity with all oppressed peoples, whether they reside in the United States, South Africa, or anywhere around the world. Let's be unequivocally clear. Advocating for the rights of the Palestinian people is not synonymous with denying the rights and security of the Jewish people. The fight for justice in Palestine is not an assault on any particular group, but an unwavering stand against the policies of a Zionist state that has for far too long stripped Palestinians of their rights. We must remember that numerous Jewish voices also resound in the calls for just Palestine and their voices must not be silenced. In our relentless pursuit of justice for the Palestinian people, we must also acknowledge that it is in the best interest of the entire world to seek a just and enduring solution to the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. It is a pursuit in the name of peace, stability, and the dignity of all mankind. But let me underscore this. The battle for justice in Palestine is not merely a political struggle. It's an elemental moral battle. It's the fight for the most basic human rights of a people who have suffered these injustices for far too long. It's the fight for the right to exist in peace and security, free from the ceaseless specter of violence and dispossession. If you're not careful, the newspapers will have you hating the people who are being oppressed and loving the people who are doing the oppressing. I implore every person of conscience, regardless of their origins or beliefs, to stand steadfast with the Palestinian people in their unwavering quest for justice by any means necessary. Let us unite in building a world where every soul can live in freedom and dignity, where the rights of every individual are not just respected, but celebrated. The struggle for justice in Palestine is a universal fight, a resonating echo of the battles waged by oppressed people across the globe. It's a battle we must champion, a torch we must carry, and a legacy we must honor. Thank you. And free Palestine. Okay, so would you believe if I told you that that speech was from in the 60s and the man who is talking is Malcolm X, who dead long time? That speech is from in the 60s. So all you young ears will listen. No, so we are here they know by your news every day. From CNN and BBC and them thing there. 
is from the 60s and even beyond, from 1948 and beyond. That was Malcolm X. It sounds like him at talk about now. Same thing I go on. Malcolm X attacked that. Serious, serious thing. Yes, ill. Ill. Blessed. Blessed man. Yeah, man. I like the, the piece of Yeti interview, you know? Yeah, the Virgin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, it's refreshing. Yeah. You know, because that be a BBC and be you know, all of them news, there were some people at the time. Yeah, when the Virgin yeah. interview one of the man, them, who used to down there. Mm. You know, top yeah. barbecue. Yeah, I, mean, I, mean, I have some link down there too, you know, a man where, you know, about... As I tell you, say, at that barbecue, a long time, a long time, I tell you, say, at that, I go on down the man. It's just a similar thing like Jamaica, you know, 21 family, you know. Mm. Where, you know, people just come take out well to Jamaica. You wouldn't like where the Chinese them are there, you know. You know, because when the Chinese them come here and them set up them business, you know. And the whole of the money gone back, you know. And that is a school them now build, gone to China, you know. You see, so I had a similar thing. The 21 family, them bank for their money are foreign, you know, and 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 taxpayers still have to build the school and build certain things, and we have to borrow money from IMF and build anything that we have built. So the the tools are left by the taxpayers, same way, you see, it can we? So you know, when barbecue, kind of my time, I listen when I listen to barbecue, you know, I listen good enough and dissect him, you know, seeing cause some of the things, you know, mm -hmm. and I say. The man said him could have never be a gangster. See him? In a one-hand yeah. interview where man... Me uh, said, man. Me him said. See him? Because him is not a gangster. See him? But, you know, I mean, him more like barbecue that he ate. And where the man tried, the man tried to get the gang. Them. That's why the same thing, the name G9, you know. Because mm. nine, a nine gang in, in peace together, you know. Yeah, see, yeah. like him, I tried to strung up the thing where it's strong in a way where people can see say, well, then, yes, yeah, a freedom, a freedom they want to fight for. Yeah. See, because where man could have really a, 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 a fight for, yet yeah, for no freedom. See, you know, see how the place look. Mm. See, and, 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 and the people that were, were control the place. See, because even, even the same president, or Matilda said, um, drop out. At the same high thing, you know. Mm. See, where, 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 the, where that go on, you know. See, and 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 I saw him get after him. I tell them, them say, well, then boy, the people them forget back something now. And yeah, any one of them would talk like say, them want the people them get back now something to do for the people and forget educated. Is a problem. See, is a problem to the 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 the, 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 the Alibaba them. So, you know, I just. That I go on. So when I hear your boss interview there, you know, me I say, yeah, you know. You know, I love me love I go on. But yeah. so I hear one side of the story you know, about about them one send police guy yet and soldier guy yet. Yeah, do that, 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 but but, America give them money for go. Uh, yeah, for go get, you know, you have a telephone long time, say, I'll get them all get the people them place. Yeah. The, where them all, well, you where them all you hear the rule of them all go down never play you now. A security guard, you know. They might yeah. go down, they go pay, you know. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. they might do them all left. They might some people gas station, some people that, and some people. But in a, it, anyhow, them kill one Haitian. See, you see something we're going down there. So. Mm -hmm. If they ever go down there and kill one Haitian, even a Haitian gangster, and the people them know they are dead, they might go swarm them, they might mash them up. Mm -hmm. So as I just say, my my man a better. Brief, say, nobody no go down there, the soldiers no go down there, go <laughs> there. Yeah, because... What a prick, eh? What a prick, eh? Because some people don't understand, you know, say, people and no one know how everybody has studied, how everybody has watched. And I just like in a Jamaica. Like, oh, you see some people go up on the website, no one know about who corrupt from who no corrupt, yeah. and who a good government from who no good government. So when some people come out of the parliament and talk, 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 a lot of the people will laugh after them now, you know, because we are educated people then. You see? Yeah, yeah. So uh, when you look on the whole thing, 
how Haiti are run. Jamaica now run different. Jamaica now run different, you know. Jamaica have, have some call center. See, I'm a little niece. See, in Canada. And she had told me so when she, when she checked for her money, because she have her little cousin down there, the two of them reason and things. She had a car center, and she, her cousin had a car center. And she said when she checked up for her money, for her money, six times. Six times, the, the cousin money down there. Uh. See? Six times, the cousin money down there. So you just imagine said all the car center thing with them have a work work all the UM. So that's slavery. Suppose they don't even appear them even three, three times the money then. Mm. See? You know what I mean? So when you look at the whole thing, see, all right. Look at even the, when 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 they marry them budget. The last thing when them talk about, you know, are the are the and the last thing when they put in, in thing there, you know, are the are the minimum wage, you know. The man is that I forgot it, you know. As somebody carry the paper come give him, you know. Mm. See? As somebody carry the paper come give him and he say, oh, yeah. See? And him not in the inform the private sector, them, and all them people. Because maybe him free to inform them, tell him, say, he won't put two grand. See? Upon the people, upon the minimum wage. And all them people, just to show all them people that deal with poor people are, are, are small people. So look at all the taxi business now. See? The taxi man them. This is something where they might talk about from what year? Long and from time. last year. Yeah. So 16% the man them forget. And when the man them forget the 16% and on the 1st of April, the man them sees it and stop it, say it can't go on because then you read a budget from all long. See, and you don't know, say the man them can't get the 16% till an emergency need your call, see, with, with the next bigger one, they will say, my, my represent the man them. See? Uh, uh, and, 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 and I tell them, said, taxi can't get. And them can't tell the people them who own, who own the store, them or who own the, 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 the supermarket, them, them thing there, you know. Because them people, they just raise up them thing. Yeah, you understand? See? So, them leave now the taxi man, them we have to buy a part and buy a whole thing. And look at the time when them, when, when them bring off that. Them bring off that when the road lights, the thing are going on, you know. That means, say, if a man come out on a, on a protest, he could not get a road license. Mm. You see? So, you see, when you look on the whole thing, at the same thing I go on, I hate you, I go on, yeah. And you see, if we, the real roaming them people, yeah, and get them to, and get them on a level, see? Them people are going to keep on a take the people and the fool, and the people might have got revolute. See? So, when, when me hear you play the 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 the, 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 the interview then, see? It's refreshing because you know some people know say and you like where well, some people are talk like the hear America talk about gangs take over eating gangs on the well, that's 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 But that's the prevailing talk everywhere and all the answer too. You know you yeah, the news yeah, there, yeah, the yeah, news. Because, because, yeah, because the people now read and dissect now. Yeah. See? Because if, if 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 you watch and you listen, see? With barbecue, you know. The policeman can't come take over no gang, you know, and no, no gangster never follow no policeman, you know. See? A barbecue was a ex police. See? Mm -hmm. So you must say a uh, something barbecue a fight for. See? Or he must have something different about him where people follow him. See? Yeah, people yeah. not follow and criminal a man who just get up, see, and him a police and a next man a criminal and a man a follow like a man I go trust him, no trust no in no, 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 no. yeah, yeah, yeah. man a freedom fighter. You see? Well, I'm well, glad well, watch I see him the do Mandela. Yeah. And Winnie. Remember them call them terrorists? Them to the yeah, terrorists watch list, you know. But all the watch list are we have and when we look out Jamaica push out, you know, in a Willie Mandela, Mandela case, you know, and stamp with a tarot, you know, from them time there, you know. And when we look on Jamaica now, see, it just show you how oh, them people that can, can really break down things and mash up Jamaica and have, have Jamaica on a level. Yeah. It, it, well, not in the world no respect Jamaica again. A man can, you mean, you mean to say, 
we are going to Palestine with 30 or 1,000. With, with the, them, I give the statistics, right? 30 or 1,000 people there. Women and children. With them fine, with them fine. With them, with them fine. Yeah, they, that's how the rubble they pan. See, and you, you go, you go for make a vote, and you could make a vote, you can't make a vote, say, no, the war is this not for go on. No, them, you, them you, not you, that. You, you know, for the vote, they eh? gonna tie they it. They tell me no motor. Them people are where I run, I run, Jimmy, me could I get up. No one has said me a defendant. No, sir. In a, in a, what kind of, what kind of way, me could I see children and, and women. See, all right. Lupan, Lupan even all, um, the president, no. The president, him, no. He must send the bomb and I supply the bomb. Then same way and I drop food. Joe Biden. And, yeah, Joe Biden. And then they must send plane and I drop food on the people. Them, them I kill off the people. Them, you know, so the food drop on some people and them dead. And them dead. See, yeah, the water, and, yeah. And, and some people are trying to get so people can't swim all drunk. And, see, for, you, 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 you ever see a wicked, you ever see something? Them, uh, so, yet. Me and them are send bomb there, you know. Joe Biden, I, I send one of bomb, bomb and... Two thousand bomb, yeah. Yeah, brand new. Two thousand bomb. See, yeah. the same way, I give the people them... I'm behind them, I tell the people them, say, watch out now. I'm go on too bad, you know, ease up. See, and me as a, as a leader, me as a prime minister, me as a president of our country, and me, me go for go vote, say, this not for go on, I that not for go on. And me, I said, me not vote. You know, vote, that no means, that no means, say, you know, care what we are, man. See? No, me, no, see, what do you motor, man, motor. Let me tell you something, man. Something when I say, I go on even at Jamaica right now. See? Me, me, I feel really, I wonder. Because when you look at the whole thing, see? This is something I've heard of now, a man of all places, where they might pay all the rent, tax, pay as money. See? And them now, you know, the place. The place now I use. See? And tax payers money are go out and politicians are get the money and see and all them kind of thing. Eh? See and look on Jamaica. When you look on the road them we want fix. When you look on the people we want go downtown front. Of. The court, the court front the people make sure you go front of the court them, you know, where the judges yeah, can't yeah. see them, you know. See and and Peter's all, lean. Yeah. You know, Peter's lean and all them thing, you know. Yeah. And when you look on the amount of money with them people, yeah, see a waste and can give a comfort. See, but it 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 it's it not different from AT. Them can give a comfort. See, they know they can give a comfort. Them know where they. Mm. Them know where they. But we just say that true. Yeah, you understand? Yeah, you yeah, see, yeah. so we have to move door. Yeah, man. See, in general. Call back yeah, tomorrow, man. I'll listen to you. Yeah, man. All right, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I'm call somebody. I'm not calling the day. Me so realize that. Yeah. Me realize that. All right. All right. Bless so you guys, you know, we will come forward there. Little more from this, from two o'clock to five forty-five. And now I remember, say Sunday, we there from two o'clock to six o'clock. We want you love Shane Clark. Yes, Shane Clark. Hey, watch her. We know say a whole heap of one. Still, their country I drive come at town from the other day, you know. Why, well, you know, say, you feel just do what you're supposed to do. And that is drive safe. And we can't tell you enough, you know. Somebody just sent me a thing a while ago. Eh? Two people dead. And that a sentan, sentan, yeah. Two car crash in a sentan, two people dead. No, that's what I'm saying for those. What you want do, man? You don't know, drive them really. See, the problem with them you trying is that they never go and do you not know, driving thing, you know. They just get a license and them get a little car and them just decide to say, well, I'm a driver. You don't know, drive her, you know. You know, if you just ease up, Regin, too much, too much ones are dead. Car, it was gone, man, no a car. <laughs> 